Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my cash stopping for week 2 of January. We're just going to get right into it and get the money out. So I think I should have about £470 here. So we'll get that counted and just double check. Okay, so I've got the £5 for my dice challenge. And then we've got 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 94, 4, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 50 by 60, 65 and 70. So we've got 470 in total and then we'll get into it. Right. So starting off with my Safiano, we're going to be putting £80 into groceries. So we've got 20, 40, 60 and 80. We've got £5, oh, we've got £10 sorry, going into household, that's recently changed. <clears throat> I'm just finding like we're running out of things more often now. Um, but yeah, that's fine. Fuel's getting 30, so we've got a 20 and a 10. I hope everyone's had a lovely first week of January. It's been crazy for us, eventful, but we're, we're here, we're fine, we're all good. Uh, miscellaneous is getting five. I'm not taking the miscellaneous envelope away because when I do, I'll need it. And spending is getting 10, so we'll do the dice challenge to see what we're actually getting. It's not actually getting 10 because it's getting a 5 and the pound coins. <laughs> but hey ho. Okie dokie. We're actually so close to completing this, which I'm really buzzing about. Right, let's see. Oh, sugar. Lost the dice. Right, we've got a six, so we'll pop five in here and a pound into this one. And we've got four pounds for spending money this week. Let's colour that in. Yeah, we're getting to like the last row now, so I think once if I obviously if it's completed, I think I'll just re-roll. Um, I've got a feeling I'm going to be left with these 10s though. But, I mean, it's fine. Whatever. Okay. So we've got £4 for our spend money this week. <clears throat> Which, I'm not needing anything, but we'll see. And then Days Out and Lucas are not getting anything this week at all. Because they're monthly. Right, in here we're going on to my one. So this is, has only got a lonely 20 in it because I spent it on um, Slimming World where I had totally forgotten about it. Um, so I'm not going to colour one in, I actually need to take two away but I'm not going to bother doing that right now. So it's got £40 in Kerry. Self care is not getting anything, mum's not getting anything, Grace is getting 10. So Grace has got 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 140 in Grace. Lucas is getting a 10 as well. So Lucas has got 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45. Ryan's actually getting a 20 and this is kind of in preparation for his birthday which is in February. So we've got 20 and 40 in Ryan. Again, I'm not ticking one off. Um, once we've had our birthdays then we'll be doing this challenge seriously. 
Um, time offence isn't getting anything and girls trip is getting 50. That 10 is not meant to be in there, it's meant to be another one. This 10 is from, um, it's actually from Vinted but my brother was needing to transfer £10 so I transferred him £10, he gave me the cash and that's um, meant to be in the Vinted folder or whatever, side hustle. So that is, and needs to go in there. Um, yeah, so we're putting 50 towards girls challenge at uh, girls trip so we've got 20 40 and 50 and we'll write draw color and <laughs> um, 10 15 20 30 35 45 50 oh gosh 50 we're only a tenner away which is super exciting because that's my first goal of 2023 once that's completed. Okay, I just want to find the tennis from somebody else now. <laughs> no, I won't. I'll just, I'll be patient. It's fine. It's for April anyway, so. That's my next kind of big thing. <clears throat> so, we should have 440 in here. I am really due a condensing video, so maybe I'll do that in February. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 80, 94, 4, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35 and 40. So we've got 440 in the girls' trip and we're, or we're only 10 pounds away from completing our first 2023 goal. Which is mad, absolutely mad. Okie dokie. So next we're going into uh, long term. There's nothing in short term getting stuff this week. Home improvement was originally meant to be getting 30, but I put that 30 and the 10 that was originally in here towards um, the new fire alarms, smoke alarms and heat detector that we needed for our house. Um, it is now against the law to have not interlinked um, smoke alarms so that passed in February 2022 um, so we're really due then so that's it just totally kicked on slip of my mind. Dan's not getting anything um, we're going to skip, skip right to wedding so wedding I actually need to change my placeholders um, I don't even know if I'm going to have the right ones actually 200 400 yeah 400 so for a wedding we're actually needing to swap the placeholder from 500 to 400 because we spent 100 pounds and that was on save the dates and um what else oh the registrar deposit so we're 400 in the bank and we're getting 100 today 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. <clears throat> um, oh, goodness, money's flying everywhere. Right, so for wedding, we've got 200, 300, 400 in the bank, and then we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 40, 60, 80, 600, 20, 30, 40, so 640 in wedding. Obviously, with it only being nine months, we're starting to pay more things off. Um, and yeah, we're just getting organised, I suppose. So this is one that's going to really need to get concentrated on within the next while because I... Now, this is not a big... It's not a small mistake, to be honest. But basically, um, I've been paying it on monthly, like the wedding venue. Um, and I thought I only had £900 to pay. Turns out I've actually got 1,900 because they miscalculated the last time on the invoice and the one that I went by before, which was back in like 2021, um, was the wrong amount. They'd added up wrong. I, I don't know how. Um, so yeah, we're actually £1,000 down from what I was expecting. But if I do need to, I will take it out of a um, month ahead. I'm actually considering just putting it into bed in because we've got £300 in here. And I'm thinking that that would be maybe a good idea just to concentrate on wedding just now and then put one month ahead to the side because obviously we've got one emergency fund. Um, 
so let me know what you think that's what i'm thinking of doing just because i'm feeling a bit stressed with it um because of this obviously little mishap so i'm thinking maybe taking away one month ahead condensing that with wedding and bulking this right up so yeah let me know what you think but yeah it's a bit stressful <laughs> um right what else are we at so we're at emergency next <clears throat> So emergency is just getting five. Again, I might just stop putting five into here. So we've got 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, and we've got a thousand. So we've got a thousand and fifty-five in emergency. I think weddings need to be my number one priority right now. Um, but I'm still thinking about it, eh? I don't know. Let's see, let's see. Um, right, we're getting twenty pounds for one month ahead. So we've got 10 and 20. Um, so we've got 100 in the bank and then we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 320 pounds. So yeah, that's what I mean. I just, that would take us up to like a thousand pounds just about for wedding um yes yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm really thinking about that um <clears throat> okay next we're actually going back into short term because i forgot that we are actually stuffing health so health is just getting 10 pounds so we've got 20 40 50 and 60 in health And then we're going on to Christmas and challenges. Um, Christmas I've got a good bulk for already. Again, I might just put this on the back burner until I've got wedding completed. Um, but today we're adding £60. So I think we're going to do... <clears throat> what have we got? We've got... There for challenges. Um, so we've got 20, 40, 50, 60. We'll probably do a 50 and a 10. Yeah, that would be fine. 50 and a 10. So we've got a 50 down here. And we've got 10 up here. So we'll get that done. Twenty. So here's a ten. And then we're gonna go straight down to fifty. And then must be quite far down, but it is like and we've got £50 for in here. See, I'm really happy with how we're going with Christmas, actually. Um, but as you know, I under-budgeted for last year. So I'm really trying my hardest just to double the amount this year. Um, right, next we're going to challenges. So we're going into here. So our seasonal challenge, I'm actually planning on, once I've completed this, it's going to wed in as well, just because I need to just get it done, to be honest. It's stressing me out already. And it's only nine months away. <laughs> um, and do you know what? You've got loads of like little bits that I need to add on, and oh, you just forget about them, to be honest. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 70, 75 in this winter challenge. From Budget with Char. And we've got the yearly savings, and that's getting 10 this week. So we've got 20 and 30 in this challenge. <clears throat> and I, this um, yearly savings, it's just going to act as a buffer for anything. So... 
if for instance I've budgeted £50 for time with friends and then a last minute night out comes up and I've already spent my money then I'll use it towards that. Last month I used it towards Costco because I was going unexpectedly and there was £100 in here. So yeah this is just going to act as a buffer for any envelopes that are needing a little bit more attention or I've had unbudgeted spends for um, but obviously I don't actually have any credit cards so literally all the money that I spend has got to come from somewhere um, because I don't have credit cards so yeah but anyway that's all the money gone I hope you all enjoyed this video I've got a few mentions that I just want to do because I'm starting to get back into the habit of mentioning a few channels I watch every week um, so to start with we've got Budget with Shan um, Budget with Shan is quite a new channel um, if I remember I think she might be under 150 subscribers so go and give her some love um, also Ali Budgets Ali Budgets has been a around for a wee while um, always loved Ali's videos she's low income um, so good if you're looking for low income channels and she's on 261 subscribers so well give or take because obviously this is a day behind um so yeah go and give her some love as well and then the last one is my money matters esther esther's a lovely channel i absolutely love her channel to watch um always got new fun challenges to do as well and yeah so go and give those the a lovely subscribe and watch please if you don't mind um and i will catch you all with my next video bye bye